Actress Takia Crystal Kima is known for her roles on the hit 90s shows in Living Color and Cosby, and more recently Disney's That's So Raven. Kima did not go to college to study acting. When she arrived at Florida a and University in 1980, she planned to major in business. As stellar as the business program was and is, from the first week that I was here, I got in everything theater. At the time, FAMU's theater program had only about 15 students on the roster and just two faculty members. Today, it has 85 students and eight faculty members. The environment allowed Kima to grow as an actress and dancer. I was in the freshman cl class play, the which was an um, odd version of The Wiz. The people who danced in that play formed our own dance company. Kima switched gears and graduated with a theater degree in 1984. She learned leadership lessons that helped her succeed in show business and in life. A theater professor became a mentor. One of the things that he instilled in me is kind of the fighting spirit that, that I have. A spirit that helped Kima become a producer, director, actress, author, and last November, FAMU's homecoming convocation speaker. You can be a millionaire. That same week, FAMU also honored Kima as one of 125 top alumni. A plaque at FAMU's Eternal Flame commemorates her donation of $150,000 for an endowed scholarship in theater. Kima admits she wasn't familiar with historically black colleges and universities until a FAMU recruiter visited her high school. At HBCU, there, there exists a, a love, like a family, that just doesn't exist anywhere else. And I say that having attended other schools. Now she wears FAMU's school colors proudly and touts the importance of giving back to FAMU and other HBCUs. FAMU is among the country's top producers of black college graduates. In Tallahassee, I'm Kathy Yvette reporting.